Hey fam and welcome back. So when is it an appropriate time to say I love you? Someone asked me this question. They're having difficulties. Should they say it? Should they not say it? So I wanted to come here and address it today right after this. All right, fam, thanks so much for coming back. So for those of you who are finding my channel for the very first time, my name is Marshawn, and I'm your life and relationship strategist. I help men and women alike to create the relationship that they want, need, and desire. So now, when is it an appropriate time to say, I love you? Um, it really is all about the way that you are feeling, the way that you have been treated, the way that um, everything is just going in your relationship there's not really a set time to say you know what today i am going to say i love you to my spouse or um to my potential boyfriend girlfriend or whatever it really is dependent upon many factors and all of those things just add up where one day you're like you know what i actually really love this person like they are bringing value and meaning to my life and it's about time that they really know how much I appreciate them in the in the words of you verbally saying I love you to him or to her. Um, again, it really is all about a gut feeling. It's not necessarily wait until date five or wait until date six or wait until date 12. You know, it's not really a set time like that. It really is dependent on a few other factors, which I want to give you as well. You want to make sure that at the very least, you guys have had at least two arguments. Why two? Because you really want to know how this person acts and they react. Are they punching walls? Are they punching you when they don't get their way? Like what is actually happening in the face of you guys arguing? You know, is it, is it civilized? Is it horrible? So just make sure that you know what's actually going on. Um, and how your partner reacts to things specifically when they don't get their way so think about that argument next thing to think about is make sure that the relationship has actually been defined so you do not want to say this to a person that you're just dating that um, there have been no talks about moving the relationship or you are just feeling like oh wow I love this person but you don't know exactly where they're at you want to have an idea where they're at and specifically um, I would have to say after you guys have at least brought the title on a boyfriend and girlfriend because you don't want to get caught up in a situation where you know where I'm pouring out all of my feelings to this person because we're spending all this time together but there has been no definition put on your relationship, no title put on your relationship. And so you just put yourself out there to say, you know what? I do love you. And it's okay to love somebody else, right? I'm not saying that you shouldn't. Of course you should love somebody else. But you specifically want to share that special moment with the person who has um, created an attachment back to you in the form of at least girlfriend, boyfriend. The next thing that you want to think about is to make sure that you're saying it when you're meaning it, not saying it just because they said it to you or um, feeling obligated to do it one, um, right after they say it to you. Quick story about my own personal life. <laughs> when my husband first told me that he loved me, I was like a deer in headlights because it really, it really came out of the blue. And because I know that I should not have just said it back just because he said it to me first. I literally was like, you know what? I don't remember exactly what I said. It's been a few years now, but um, I know I said something to the effect of, you know what? I appreciate you telling me this. I have to say that I'm not there yet, but I am moving in that direction. And of course, when I get there, you'll hear the words. But um, yeah, so I didn't say it back to him right when he said it to me. Uh, again, it was a shocker. <laughs> It was a shocker in the sense that it really, it literally came out of nowhere. There were no signs, quote unquote, to say that it was leading up to it or anything. I think we were actually on the phone the first time he said it, um, which actually brings me to my next point. You really want to say it in person. But um, for me, and at, for me, it didn't deter me to say, okay, this dude, he's going crazy. Because we were spending a lot of time together. We were always on the phone, on dates, etc. So, um it made sense to say it, 
but uh, for me, I was just like, am I actually there? But I don't want to just say it just because he said it to me. And so I, I literally didn't say it back to him that night. I think I actually didn't say it back to him to like a month later or even six weeks later. It was it was a few weeks. It was it was definitely several weeks later before I said it back to him. But um, just make sure that you mean it when you say it. And her my example. Uh, my husband, he didn't get deterred. He was just like, okay, I understand. It, it, it's all good or whatever. We continued to date on. It wasn't like a big blemish in our relationship or anything like that, which is a great sign because, again, you don't want the person to feel, you don't want the person to pressure you and you feel the pressure that you have to say it back to them. So, yes, those are several things to think about before you say, I love you to your spouse, um, to your girlfriend, boyfriend. Again, definitely make sure that you at least, at the very least, have the title of boyfriend and girlfriend. And then just evaluate your relationship, okay? So those are some things to take into consideration. I hope that you are able to use this information. Definitely leave me a comment down in the comment section below because I, I want to hear. What was your experience like when your boo told you I love you? Were you the first person to say it or did he or she say it to you first? What was your reaction? I absolutely want to know. I will see you guys in the next video.